better than zeros, but you know, I think that two one you'd like to be able to close it out. And uh, but based on the way the game was played, yeah, I, I don't. I'm not saying we're feel that we were lucky. I don't think we were in a lot of offense. We just couldn't couldn't get a good handle on a lot of things tonight. Forward moving pucks. It was a tough game. Tough game for them to grind through. We had some guys just a bit off, uh, but they worked at it. I mean, they they competed hard. It was a hard grinding game. It just wasn't a sharp game. Colorado's an improved hockey club, aren't they? Kind of like you talked about from yeah. before the game. They move better for sure. Um, got lots of confidence. Got some young guys got a, another year under their belt, so they uh, they can do some things off the rush for sure. Player group has been pretty good playing with the lead. Uh, did you see a little drop off? No, I didn't. Today? I didn't. As a matter of fact, like I. Uh, I thought we had stretches there the first half of that third period. We were pretty darn good. We, we struggled on the power play tonight, and you, you see it. I, we didn't look like we had a tremendous amount of jump start to finish. Worked hard, but couldn't get a handle on a lot of pucks. You know, we got three guys around the puck on that tying goal. Just couldn't get a handle on it. And, um, but no, I, I didn't. I didn't feel sag. Just clarification: the first goal when Hellebuck lost his mask. Did you get any word from them as to why it did count? I think the puck went away from it, and uh, one of the referees, the better just say, I think they just thought it was a good call. Okay. Well, you bumped to Matthew Perot for that uh, second line for a bit in the third. Was that just we're we're, we're going to go to three, and uh, I didn't want to leave Maddie on the bench. Hey, guys.